Hey, hi, I'm Anthony. And this is Richter. We are survival rangers from Boswell Survival, and we run a YouTube uh, page uh, forward slash uh, Alt Smackdown, South African bushcraft survival and outdoors. And uh, shh, get very quiet because we're going to watch another Rob the Rangers video and check some very cool animals. Shh, come, 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 let's go check these animals. Come. So, let's see what happens there as well. What it's hoping for is to grab one by the nose and pull it under. And, uh, I suppose just showing off there a bit. Like that. That was the crocodile having a go. Is he trying to eat them? Trying to get, it's trying to get them, yeah. How successful are they? I, well, I've only... <laughs> I do that. Did you see the crocodile in between? It's not doing a very good job of hiding, is it? No. no. Yeah, there's a lot of competition between the bulls for uh, access to the resources. They fight with one another to get closer to the front of the group. But uh, it's actually the females that lead the group. Oh, okay. Um, the bulls, because they're constantly fighting between one another to get to the front, means it's not always the same one at the front. So the, the, the females stay constant at the, at the, mm -hmm. at the top of the group, uh, show them where to go and so on. Uh, as the bulls lose ranking and, and lose uh, uh, condition, they get pushed further and further towards the back of the group. So these, like these ones that are turning up late would be low ranking bulls, and they're the ones that the predators would target. They look older, are they? Hmm? They look older, are they? Yeah, often older, or sometimes younger bulls that haven't been able to push to the front yet. Yeah. And they, they will um, often uh, leave the groups entirely and form little bachelor groups instead of uh, staying in a, a big group like this. I hate those tails. I know, I just watched them. <laughs> Look at that one's coming out. Oh, that coming out. And the hippo yeah. coming out of the water there. Yeah, yeah, Let's try it again. <laughs> he's not, he's not doing a very good job of it, is he? So he's always here on his own, is he? Buffaloes don't look too fussed about the fact that the croc's trying to bite their nose. Thank you. 
Yes, it would be uh, one dominant male at least, and then um, the, the, his females and youngsters. And do they walk from hole to hole? They do. They, do. they, they can walk quite long people. distance at night time. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to like, subscribe, and share, and all of that sort of stuff. Thank you. Remember to go and check out the survival tips in South African bushcraft on Anthony's channel. Go and say hello from me and support the South African YouTube community. You can also follow me on all the social networks with the hashtag NowFilming for live updates from Safari.